Hello everyone, this is Prepper Nation with a quick video on my uh, water reclamation system. This is a, also a shout out to LDS Prepper for the great instructions he had for uh, creating his. I followed his instructions pretty much to the letter. Right down to the cinder blocks, the 6 mil black wrap, but I didn't have enough room to go two stories with my totes so I just went to single level put two side by side and it all worked out really really well now there's a couple of little things here I just want to point out I got my pipes just slightly propped up until I can find a, a, a correct sized prop for holding up the pipes. But aside from that, this little boy is done. I've even included an excellent, excellent first flush system that I saw on LDS Preppers videos. I mean, look at that bad boy. He's perfect. And when I took down that gutter, this, this thing just fit right in there. I didn't have to do any special cutting. It just happened to work out that way. But this thing is just great. And as you can see here, after the stuff comes down for the first flush, you know, it fills up this tube here on the right then pops over here to the tube on the left and then it shoots back up here hits that little guy and he'll run over here pops on down fills up the first tote and then he'll go over here and he'll fill up the second tote and then lastly if there's any more water coming down It'll pop over here. Now what I'm going to do here is I'm going to attach a flexible hose to feed straight into this 55 gallon drum. Now I'm going to have it go into one side and then I'll just put another elbow over here on the right because it's just like the bungs on the top there. I'm going to put a two inch uh, male adapter on both bungs and have a feed in and a, and a uh, feed out. and. Uh, so if there's any more water in addition to the uh, water that comes into this runoff, it'll just overflow and that'll be that. Well, I just wanted to say thank you LDS Prepper, because now I have got, well maybe I don't have water yet, but I do have the means to collect it. Oh, one dumb thing, these little uh, tops here, um, they were really hard to get off. I end up uh, taking a, a bar clamp and uh, you know with a couple pieces of wood on both sides of those uh, of that cap there and then tighten down the bar clamp I was able to put the necessary leverage to twist it off. Uh, that way I was able to get it off without breaking it, without cutting it, without doing anything else and uh, uh, you know, applied the silicone just like you said and put it back on and everything's hunky-dory. Later.